All right, here we are. So I got the rear center con or the front center console removed because underneath that is our SRS module. This needs to be flashed. And so a place called myairbags.com will do that as well as seat belts, which is nice. So if we look under here, we can see that right here is where the air passes through to go through the rear vents. Right here is for the floor diversion. So when you change it on the screen up here, um, it diverts these little doors. They're called blend door actuators. And it moves the air to underneath the rear seats. Um, right here is the logic. I'm pretty sure this is what allows the car to start and stop with the key card. You got a ground wire right here. And then this right here is for your USB stuff. Um, you know, if it has a cord like this, one of these plugs right here, it means that the car, because um, previously Tesla was not offering back in the day, you know, 2021 when there was the chip shortage, they weren't offering this. So you couldn't plug stuff in like USB controllers or anything or sentry mode cameras. You had to go in through the glove box. So this means that that has that functionality where I can plug a USB controller into my center console. Yeah, so pretty cool. Um, the car will still run and drive. Once I remove this, I'll just have no um, uh, autopilot and traction control. So somehow, somehow this is related to the traction control. And yeah, so I'm going to get it out.